Hello everyone, Segmentator here, and welcome to At Dead of Night. Just go to bed, Hannah. Well, listen, make sure you're not Ah, Maya, I presume. Don't be alarmed. Uh, your friend has booked you in. Uh, let me just check. Ah, yes. Uh, room 101. It's all been paid for, so you don't have to worry about anything. You are very nice friends. Very nice. And there's uh, quite a few of you I see as well. Nice to see so many fresh, young faces. <laughs> for a change. Uh, you're here for the music festival in town, I presume? Yeah, we were supposed to be camping there tonight, but... <laughs> There's hardly weather for that, is there? <laughs> uh, will you be staying for breakfast? I don't think so. We'll probably just get going. That's fine. And uh, if you don't mind me asking, Maya, would you be interested in uh, the entertainment tonight? Tonight? Uh, starts around midnight, usually. It's... It's me doing it, actually. Comedy. I do this comedy character called uh, Hugo Punch. He's sort of this comedic sociopath, <laughs> says things that you're not supposed to say, and that sort of thing. It's quite popular with students. I don't think so. We're all just going to bed, I think. Are you sure I can't twist your arm on this? It's okay, I'd rather just go to bed. Sorry. Fine, fine, fine. Which way are the rooms? Um, just take the lift. Uh, you're on the first floor. Okay, thanks. Oh, and, and then drop your key off in the box, uh, if you will, Maya, please, tomorrow. Okay. Hmm. Best show in town and no takers. <sighs> Who needs... Proper entertainment when you've got YouTube and my face or whatever. Stupid, uncultured. You don't like rude children. They're naughty. Don't start this again. I don't want to hear it, okay? Not tonight! Naughty children are bad eggs. They need to be taught a lesson. Shut up! Just shut up! You always do this! They're paying customers! They haven't done anything to you! Just leave them alone! Bad eggs need cracking, whack them hard and crack the shell! Kick them down the stairs to hell! You know what you need to do, Jimmy? Show them who's boss. That's the way to do it. <laughs> Thank you. 
All right then. Uh, this device you found, select to turn it on. It can detect spirits' voices if you're near enough to them. You need to find a compass and scrying mirror. If you haven't seen it, go to the menu and watch the tutorial before you continue. All right, hold on a second. All right, okay. So, have the receiver, so now we need to investigate the hotel. Did I not do anything in this room? Doesn't look like it. Fair enough. Alright, nothing around here. Alright, the door's locked. Now look for the keyhole. Alright, too dark. Whoops. Alright. Okay, that's locked. Need to find a compass and scrying mirror. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm guessing I'll probably need to go up and search my room first, maybe. Alright. Let's okay, locked. Locked. No, nope. yeah, we've already done that, but I'm not used to point and click style games. Right, you, are you also locked? Yay! Just like Silent Hill. Um, what about the basement? Oh, this is back in the... Heard crying. Right, let's... Ah, here we go. Let's go to the first floor. Keep an eye out for Jimmy. Okay, my room is back this way. What's in here then? Oh, a storeroom. Anything in here? Okay. This might just be a place to hide. Room 106. My room was 101. I 
112, 113. Okay, so I need to go. That's 107. 108. I'm going the wrong way. One eleven, one ten. So you should be one oh nine. Okay. This is a very weird layout. Yes, I know what I need to find. I'm trying to get to my room to find it. No, hang on. It said my room was this way. Ah, here we go. Can I lock the door? No, but I can look through the glass, the uh, spy hole. Fair enough. Okay, I found a chef's hat. I found some whiskey bottles. Stairs, floor one. Doors can be locked or unlocked with the right key. Key to stairs, floor one. Whiskey bottle, chef's hat. Alright, okay. No reply, there are no spirits around. Loud noise means there's a spirit in a high energy state. Okay. No, yep. Yeah. We've done this. We've already done this. That's the menu. Mind. Okay, let's... Ooh, a shiny... shiny armour. Hello. Oh, right, I have a... I have a master key. Okay. Hey! Found a compass. Points towards nearby spirits. Handy. Syringe, a bottle of diazepam. Okay, now I need a scrying mirror. Thomas will point towards nearby spirits. Excellent. Ooh, this... Too dark ahead. Okay, so... Fair enough. Room four, look through the keyhole. Nothing in there. What have you got for me? Ooh, a key. Storeroom. Found a child's purse. Yeah, I know I need to find a scrying mirror. Hey! Got one. Reveals hints and clues when used in dark places. Okay, cool. Either by the door or in rooms or in the kitchen ground floor. Use the mirror to see clues about where to go and which items to use next. It'll also help you locate lost keys, compasses and the ghost box. Cool. Alright, let's try this out then.
Is that a child? Okay. So I need to go down to the basement, it looks like. I want to check out the rest of this floor, though. Now I know I can enter other rooms. Well, that's my room. But you're a storeroom, don't need to look in you. Look for the keyhole. So obviously the more keys I can find the better. Other items will help. Ooh, another key, there we go. Oh the deadlock key for 106, okay. That's useful. So I can lock room 106, can I? Key to 106. Is that not the room I'm in now? Okay. Wouldn't let me lock it though. No, I didn't want to go that way. I wanted to go here. 112. The key. Another storeroom key. Nothing in there. Right up this side. Another key. Deadlock for 112. Nothing in there. Not letting me lock rooms for some reason. Maybe that's because I'm not in any danger currently. I don't know. That's the way I came. No. I want to check all the rooms. Right, you're too dark to do anything in. I should probably just look through the... Okay, right. I need to... I'm going to make a note of that room. Because there was a person in it. Hold on. Shit. That's probably one of my friends. So it's room one one five. I'll just make a note friend question mark in there. Go. Okay, so I might have found one of my friends. Can't see anyone in here. Okay. Again, I keep forgetting to look through the keyhole first. Deadlock for 119. 
The paddle. That's a paddling. Obviously, the former residents of that room are into some kinky shit. What's this? That's uh, another story. Okay. I've done it again. Yep. Too dark to do anything, so there's no point coming in here. No, I don't want to hide. I want to leave. Haven't done you, or well, have I? Yeah, I have because I've got the key to one sixteen. Yeah, you're dark, so we can ignore those. Too dark to see anything in there. Fair enough. But again, one twenty one. Anything in here? Old cloth covered in blood. The key. Deadlock for 121. You found a bottle of turpentine and a lighter. That doesn't sound like a good combination. Twenty-two, one twenty-three. All right, going to be stuff in here. So, the room for one twenty-two. Nothing. Buckus. You found some childish, violent drawings. Red flag. Key for one, two, three. I already have a compass. Okay, I think Yeah, because I came down that way. And now I'm back around here. Okay, so. Let's go down to the. It said LG. That's probably where I'm going to encounter my first ghost. Assuming Jimmy isn't actually a ghost. In here? Is anyone there? Nothing. Is anyone there? Hey. 
Okay, I heard crying though. Hello? Um, try this again. Is someone there? Is someone there? Hmm. Noted girl in the basement. Yeah, I, I saw that. Is someone there? Hello? What's your name? Hello, Amy. Ask spirits about items you've seen. Okay. You'll see their reply when selecting the item. Okay. I saw a girl in the basement crying. Who was she? It was me. A boy called Jimmy locked me in the basement. Then he who did the child's purse belong to? It was mine. It was for my birthday, but it was stolen. Um. Who drew those violent pictures? The boy used to draw them. Okay. The boy used to draw those Why pictures. Why is there a blood-stained cloth in one of the drawers? Bottle of turpentine and a lighter. What were they for? I didn't know what they were until Jimmy showed me. Um, why was there a collection of whiskey bottles in one of the rooms? Correct. Um, Where did the wooden paddle come from? I don't know. Okay, uh, what about Where this? Where did the bottle of diazepam come from? Add to pair. Match two applies to uh, it. You think connect to work out the spirit story. Pair citing replies with item replies for faster progress. Okay. No, uh, that and that. Okay. Maybe we didn't have an answer for that. Okay. Um.
Who did the chef's hat belong to? Ah, there we go. When you said Jimmy stole things from you, does that have something to do with the blood-stained cloth? All oh, right, she's. Does it mean she's over here? Is it Amy? You gone, or am I? Did I move the wrong way? Is it Amy? She gone. Hello. Is someone there? Okay, so she's gone. I don't know where. Let's go back to the first one. And I think I'm going to end this episode here. We found our first go, so I think that counts as good progress. Really liking this so far. I'm really getting back in the in the mood for horror games, so I think this is going to be a full playthrough. And I do intend to do a full playthrough of the Mortrice Assistant when I get around to getting that game. But for now, thanks for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma Later. This has been That Dead of Night, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.